In today's video, we discuss the Corey Kluber injury and how it affects the Rangers. Rangers fans, don't forget to like and subscribe for more content. Kluber, the native of Coppell and a two-time Cy Young Award winner, suffered a small tear in his right shoulder and is expected to miss at least four weeks before being reevaluated. Dylan, what do you have to say about this Kluber injury and how will it affect the Rangers? Well, I have to say it's probably one of the worst case scenarios for the Rangers at this point. That's kind of one of the risks you get when you're trading for a middle-aged, kind of end of his career pitcher. Yeah, and you're trying to get 34, trying to get another Verlander, but this is one of the risks, you know. You're gonna he's gonna be without him for about a month, and I, I don't know. They're gonna have a hold at a spot. We'll see if they can come back from this, but this really damages their playoff hopes, Evan. Heading into the season, Rangers fans, including myself, were pretty optimistic. We had Mike Miner and Lance Lynn coming off strong years. And then we traded for Kluber. All we gave away is the Shields and Class A. And we were thinking we were going to get two-time Cy Young Award winner, although he's been, you know, kind of rusty dealing with injuries these past couple of years. But, you know, it sucks that not only is he injured, but after just one inning, he gets hurt and he's going to be on the shelf for at least four weeks. Dallas Morning News insider Evan Grant thinks that even after the four weeks, he's pretty doubtful that Kluber will actually come back and pitch. He thinks at best he's going to come out as a relief pitcher, so it's tough to see for the Rangers. Uh, they're going to call up Colby Allard, who has a career ERA just over six, but He's only pitched about 53 innings in the big league so far, so it's not over for the Rangers, obviously. It's, we're no, only it's through not. a couple of games, but there's uh, it hurts the hope here, especially with the opening of the new ballpark. The dilemma for the Rangers now is whether they should keep Kluber on a club option. The option's worth $18 million for the 2021 season. Rangers general manager John Daniels has a lot of things to debate and discuss with the front office as Kluber is heading into his age 35 season. $18 million is a lot for a guy who there's a good chance this might be his only inning pitched of this year. We don't know what he's still got. It's a lot of questions, a lot yeah. more than there are answers, but maybe Kluber will take a hometown discount. Uh, you can only hope. I mean, it's got to be frustrating if you're Daniels. You just got your dream car, and it turns out the pedal's not working correctly. You're going to have to take it back to the shop. This is one of those situations you just got to hope and pray it gets better and you finally get him back on the field at some point this season. It sucks because the sh season is short to 60 games, but hopefully the batters can get hot. Now that's all we have for you today. Leave a like. Tell us what you think about this whole Kluber situation. And we'll see you next time.